Greetings fellow humans, this is Melinda the Good here. I'm back after about a week and a half of break, which was a little bit unplanned and I had no internet whatsoever. I thought this would be a perfect time to start a new series, so this is To The Moon. This game was recommended to me by Jia Dream in the comments, so thank you so much for the recommendation. I've heard quite a bit about this game, I know it's a very story-rich type of game, and many people have told me that it's very, very sad. So let's prepare to cry together, and let's get this show on the road. I can tell this game is already going to be super sad. Just listening to the music, it's so moving. Oh, and I love the, the art here. Two little kids. Playing the piano. Dr. Rosaline, where were you looking, Neil? Dr. Watts, well, excuse me for heroically evading that squirrel coming out of nowhere. Rosalie, you ran over it anyways. Oh. You ran over it and hit a tree. Look, don't worry, it's a company car. Are you kidding me? The boss is going to kill us! Hmm, well... Just say I was saving a puppy. He likes puppies, right? He's more of a cat person. Why does the world have to be so complicated? Oh, I like the I like the humor in this already. Fine, whatever furball he fancies, crisis averted. Good, go write that on your report later. Let's grab the equipment from the car and move already. Okay, so I can click on things. Wiles, household ahead. Putting up a sign when they live in the middle of nowhere is like asking to be robbed. Okay, I guess we should come move around, look at things. Oh, I guess we should grab the equipment from the car. Got the equipment. Got the sucker, let's roll. Uh, right click to toggle menu or cancel. Ah, so we have Dr. Neil Watts, technician specialist, Sigmund Corp, and Dr. Eva Rosaline, senior memory transversal agent from the same company. Okay, nothing, and we have our equipment. The box this heavy, what's inside has got to be important. All right, looks like we could move around. Oh, is that the... Oh, come on, I crashed the car while trying to evade it. What more do you want? Not crash the car and evade it? That's asking too much. Oh, that's a little squirrel. It's all flattened. Okay, it doesn't look like we could explore too much anywhere else. Let's continue over here then. Hey, wait, don't forget the car. Just wanted to see if you remember. How thoughtful of you. Yeah, let's lock our crashed car. Can we do anything with the bird? No. Okay, let's go see what the, the house is about. Perhaps we can get some help. Oh, there's a rock blocking the way. Who put a boulder here? Maybe it's their security system. Cucumbers. We don't have time for this fluff. Let's try pushing it out of the way. 
Maybe we could find a tree branch to jack it with. Wait. Or we could just call it a night and blame it on that. Uh, let's not abort the mission. It looks a little too heavy for us to push because it's almost as big as we are. Let's go find a branch then. A branch will do. Yeah, I think I saw one right here. Okay, we've got the tree branch. Alright, this better work. What was that? I... I don't even... The rock like melted! It's some kind of... an air ball. Uh, right, we need to get going for now. Right. Oh, there's more squirrels! Wow, this is a really pretty place, but it looks a little overgrown with all the plants around. Doesn't look like we can interact with too many things over here. Is this the house? This is the house. Ma, they're here! Aww. They're so cute. Not a bad place to retire at, huh? I could do better. Night shifts, love them or hate them. You know the answer, you stupid owl. It's probably going to be another all-nighter, you know. I know. Well, sounds like they have a lot of things to do for their job. And I doubt they'll have any coffee. Shut up. Looks like they've been working together for quite a long time as well. And the ocean waves will sing lullabies. Not through your blathering, they won't. And your eyelids will... Don't forget the equipment, moron! I don't get paid enough for this. I never told anyone, but I've always thought they were lighthouses. Lily, Dr. Watts, and Dr. Rosaline, I presume. Thanks for coming on such a short notice. That's okay, I tend to be bad at predicting deaths as well. Are you the patient's daughter? Oh no, I'm just his caretaker. And these are my children, Sarah and Tommy. It's not exactly a 9 to 5 job, so Johnny lets us live here. I suppose this is- this Johnny is our man? Johnny? Listen, if it's a kid we're dealing with, I don't think we're the ones you want. No, no, he just prefers to be called that. He's upstairs right now with his medical doctor. Come with me. Oh, so someone died or is dying? Come on, grab the case and let's go. When my back breaks one day, I will sue you with the insurance claim. Oops. Okay, we got the equipment. Alright, let's head upstairs before I drop this. Uh, hold on, I just want to take a quick look around. We could go over here. There's a downstairs as well. The patient is waiting upstairs, better not waste time. Okay, guess we, they won't let us explore too much at the moment, but we can at least look at the piano. For River, Johnny Wiles. What kind of song is this? It's just two notes repeated over and over. Yeah, he's got a point. Anything over here? Not 
really... Oh, there's a clock. We can look at that. Oh, okay. I don't know if the time's going to be important. Let's go upstairs and see what this is about. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, they're gone. Whoever gets there f first gets to play the melody. Oh, it's the kids. No fair, you pushed me. Did not. Whatever, you get the boring two notes anyway. Oh, they're both playing the... together. That's so cute. Those kids are pretty good for their age. Hey, you're the one who said there was no time to waste. And incidentally, I'm the one who is carrying the weight of a small meteoroid. Yeah, yeah, come on. Oh, can we... Oh. Oh, so there's someone over there. We could talk to both of these people. I guess this is the doctor dude. This is Lily. We were just talking to her downstairs. Ready to set up? Let's look around first. Gee, you know, I think I'd like to carry this excruciatingly heavy object around some more. Thanks for asking, though. Um... Yeah, I just wanted to just take a quick look around. Oh, there's pictures over here. We should take a look at those. It's a lighthouse. Painting of a lighthouse by a cliffside. Uh, painting of a woman holding something blue and yellow. Yellow and blue. Could be a baby? It's hard to tell. A painting of an animal of some sort. A casual painting of three people. Okay. I'm gonna guess there's pretty deep meaning behind those. Can we talk to this person? Not the doctor. He's unresponsive at this point, but by the looks of things, he's still consciously hanging on. It's hard to say how long you'll have, but I would hurry. Also, he's dying. Can we talk to... No, we can't talk to him. Oh, there's more things to look at over here. It's like a desk, a bed, a selection of readings from medical journals. Is there anything down here that we can go to? Oh, it's like a bathroom. Oh, we could grab something here. Oh, it's just a light. Eh. Uh, not much we can look at. Can't look at that painting. The lights, that's what it. Let's go back. Okay, let's start the procedure or whatever we're here to do. Yeah, so just be a moment. Are you sure a common household power outlet is sufficient? No worries, we're the experts. Oh crap. Standard procedures, just keep you on your toes. How's he doing? Not so well. If I were to say he he's just got he's got just a day or two left, oh no. That's plenty of time. So you two can grant him any wish, huh? To try, at least. But we always succeed. 
because we're awesome. So what's the wish? The moon. The moon? The moon. He wants to go to the moon. The old geezers just keep on getting crazier, huh? So, can you do it? It depends. She meant to say yes. Why don't you tell us about our client here? That I don't really know much. Johnny's an odd man. Through the two years that I worked here, he rarely spoke. He worked as a craftsman for most of his life, and his wife passed away two, two years ago. I don't really know many details. I would have known more if I were his paper boy for Pete's sake. Shush, just do your thing. Well, I suppose if you look around the house, you may find some more info. I suppose Johnny wouldn't mind, since he signed for you two. Hmm, so be it. Alright, which one of us plays detective? Ooh, um... We get to choose. Wonder if it matters. Let's take Rosaline. She seems a little bit more observant. Thanks for the offer, but I'm busy leaving a butt print on this chair. Right, do continue. Tommy and Sarah can show you around. They're probably at the piano downstairs. Okay. Okay, so you, you set up the equipment, Watts. I will take a look around. So where do you looked at the paintings? Let's go find the kids. Wait, come back for a moment. I have something for you. Ooh. Here, take this. I received remote patient monitor. That will keep you updated on Johnny's status. Thanks, I was just going to ask for it. Johnny's heart monitor is now activated in menu. Oh no. Oh, it's up here, I see. Connects wirelessly to the patient's local monitor for live supervision. Alright. Okay, hang on Johnny, I'm just gonna go take a quick nip downstairs. Hey, hey kids, can you show me around? What you want? Uh, show around the house, please. Sarah and Tommy, right? Your mother said to ask you two to show me around the house. Okay, maybe we will. Maybe? I think we just need a little convincing, that's all. What do you think, Tommy? Yeah! Uh, what would you like? We want one trillion dollars, or the candy cane mom hides from us. Yeah, or that. Huh? There's a giant candy cane on top of the high shelf that we can't reach. It's in the kitchen. Ma put it there to save for when we do chores. Get it for us and we'll give you a tour through the house. We're being blackmailed. What do you say? Well... I yeah, will just give them food. My mother used to keep candy canes on high shelves too. Alright, I'll go get it. The kitchen's door is right next to the stairs. Now go! Uh, so this one? Or is it over here? It would make sense if it was over here. Oh no, this is the bathroom. I turn on the light here as well. Uh, this one? Oh, we could go inside anyways. Yeah, let's go take a look. Ooh. There's like... Oh, so this is where he does his paintings. Okay, I'm already snooping around. I don't need the kids to do the tour. Uh, so... This one? Ah, here. There's that candy cane. Oh, we can't reach it either! Okay, we need to grab like a chair or something. 
Is there no step ladder? What can I use? It's too high for me to grab. Can I open the shelf? No, I can't. Might as well get that candy cane for them while I'm here. Okay, so there's something I could use over here. But it doesn't seem like I could pick up... Oh, I could pick up this. I don't know why I can't just use a chair. Okay, got the candy cane for those blackmailing kids. No, 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 no. Go to the door. Door? Door? There we go. The controls are a little bit wonky, but this is... that's fine. Okay, here you go, kids. Alright, I got that candy you wanted. If you come and give me a tour at this instant, I won't sneeze on it. Oh, they immediately stopped playing. Okay, where do we start? I know, there's this funny room in the basement. I don't like that funny room. What do you mean by funny room? You'll see. It's weird. We need to get the keys, though. The old man hides it inside a book in the study. So the first room we're gonna go to is already pretty interesting. Okay, where is the study? Oh, 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 it was the room with the paintings, right? And this is the stair that leads down to the... to the basement. This is that book room! The key to the funny room is in the thickest book on the upper shelf. Okay, so... Here? Dusk light. The tale of a girl who fell in love with a zombie who emitted the smell of daisies when showered with gentle sunlight. Oh, let's read a passage. Sounds great. Uh, maybe another year. He chose its hiding spot well. Oh, I actually wanted to read it. Nope. Nope, not gonna happen. Alright, so we got the room key to the basement. We can open the funny room in the basement now. 